My name is Dave Rensel. I'm a senior vice president at IDC. We're a market research firm uh, that captures uh, IT industry trends. Data Age 2025 is a study that we've been doing for almost a decade now uh, at IDC, and it is about uh, capturing and in sizing how much data is actually created, captured, and replicated across the globe. We actually sized the global data sphere at 163 zettabytes by the year 2025. That's a tenfold increase from the year 2016 where we did about 16 zettabytes. What, what you have to remember about data age 2025 or global data sphere is that that's how much content's created. Some of the types of data that we capture would include uh, traditional data that you might capture on a PC, creating a PowerPoint file, um, video production obviously, drones now that has, has video uh, coverage, uh, video surveillance, anything that has the ability to create digital content to store on, on bits. As the storage industry struggles to give all the capacity that the industry desires, um, there's a cost implication. And so companies have to, have to weigh how much data needs to be transacted at any given time uh, and, and choose an appropriate mix of storage technologies to, to serve up hot data versus, say, normal business process data or even archive or cold data that can sit on some of these other storage mediums companies will have access a lot of times to the same data uh, because it's so prevalent. How that data is going to be used is what's going to make or break companies in the future. It's going to be bringing about new conveniences. It's going to anticipate uh, my needs before I even know them and I won't have to request them, they'll just simply be met. We will store what we need to store in order to bring about a lot of the conveniences in the future that we hope for that technology will bring.